Okay, John and Anna, this is a quick video on how to ping students. So what you do is you'd go to your AirWatch link. I'll give you the AirWatch link. You put in your login credentials. I'm gonna go ahead and log in. All right, now you need to go ahead and you click on account and make sure that you're at Chavez students, not employees. But notice if you wanted to find an employee device also, that's where you would go. But we're gonna do the Chavez students. So I'm gonna click there. All right, now, all these devices right here, that's all your students that have a device. So if you're looking for a specific student, you go over to the search list and you would type in their name. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just show you how it looks. So let's say we were gonna search for Andrew. Type it in. All right, there are all the Andrews in the school. Let's say Andrew Gonzalez is the one, uh, the device that we're trying to find. So I click on his device. Okay, now you come to this screen. What you need to do then is you navigate over to this drop down right next to more. You click there. Then you come over here to support and you click on find device. All right, now once we're here, um, leave the application name alone, message to be displayed. You can customize that, so who knows? Maybe that will, there will be a point in time when you want to. And this right here, number of times the sound is to be, to, to be played. So if a student left his iPad somewhere in the school, you don't know where, I don't know, maybe you wanna have it ping. Who knows, maybe it's 200 times. And then the gap between each repetition, you'll have to figure out what, what works for you. And then once you're ready to start pinging it, you click on save. Hyro told me that when you click on save, the device begins to ping. I have not tried this yet, so you guys might want to um, give it a shot. All right, that's it.